All right, welcome, welcome back, everyone. Where we're at so far with our medieval wheeled cannon. Sort of, what if I got? I think all the bones are in place. So now it's just a matter of doing the mechanism and the wheels, it looks like. So, uh, anybody new here, this is what I do. I build by these sets and build them step by step in real time so you can see all my successes and failures and hopefully how I fix my failures when all's said and done. Uh, not much else going on today, so let's jump right in with the build. Okay, here we go with step five. All our goodies in place, teeny tiny tabs over there. But um, well, while I'm thinking about it, I'm, I don't know what happened last night with the whole upload thing, but YouTube was just, you know, I. I set it up to upload. I was going to be late anyway, but it, you know it shouldn't have been that bad. I generally, I did what I always do. I set it to upload and scheduled the release and went to bed. And then when I woke up this morning, it was still in the uploading cycle. <laughs> so I don't know if there's something on my end or something on their end, but that whenever it got out was as soon as I could get it out. Let's see then. Hit that on that side. We're just making, yeah, just two of those pegs in there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then join this guy up. We got to fix the outside and they go the bottom. I think it's supposed to be these. <laughs> there it goes. pop them in. This should be a fairly quick video because I just don't I don't see there being a whole lot to build today. I think I'm going to do most of the heavy lifting on this in the next step. Is it supposed to be offset? Yep, it is. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Then we are says I'm supposed to put some wax on this and I forgot about that so I don't have my wax warmed up yet so let me take a break let the wax get warmed up and I'll apply that and we'll get going keep on going okay it's for those who don't know I had been using uh, wood lubricant but I had somebody tell me that, that stuff's a little sticky and may impede the motion so I bought I, I already had it actually the, a wax warmer and just bought a bag of paraffin wax and as I use it up I throw some more nuggets in and basically saying well, wax wax this edge and it goes on thick like this but it wears down with use to get down to what you need yeah, I can, you can see how thick that went on. But, but that, and then I think, I think they're talking here for the, the, the other wax. I'm not sure. I'm gonna hit the whole bottom of it. <laughs> sort of a vague picture. They they're the same wax here. All right, but I'm gonna move this off my mat now. Hopefully without spilling it. <laughs> Showing you what I'm talking about. Okay. That down and these are ready. So let's move on to the next piece, which is these guys. Oh. Simple enough, these just supposed to slide on to here and here. And we bring this guy back in. Okay, so this is gonna go on here and this goes through there and onto there okay so it's got to go uh -huh. 
figure this out. Okay. Of course, I picked it up backwards that time. <laughs> It will go on after the fact too. Okay, and that is some pretty <laughs> strong springage there. It's not not like ridiculous, but it's nice and stout. Okay, so I'll set you aside and bring out you guys and our cannon back on. This part. Let's see here. Now this. Let's see, got the holes. Okay, so this goes on here. Okay. Okay, it goes on to those notches on the side and then into these. These notches. Okay. So just lining all the notches up, I guess. Let me do that first. Yeah. And. Okay. And it fits rather loosely. <laughs> but I think once we tie it all together, that will. It's obviously going to go into this side too, so it's going to be a sandwich situation. So we got those three pieces left going, but that's all for step five. Moving on to step six. Okay, here we are. Step six. Ought to be fun. A little fragile action here. This thing is wobbling and wiggling around. Uh, let's see here. What's it? What A5 and G10 are the same diameter, but A5 is slightly skinnier. So that's why I've got them separated on different sides of the board so I know which one's which. <laughs> but first things first, need a couple of our rods here. Get you all the way flush there. And then you go. Oops. Put this on upside down. You go like that. <laughs> and okay, so one of them uh, goes through the slot there, and the other one goes through that one there. And actually, I think it'll make my life easier if I don't try and do that in place. <laughs> I'm just going to grab it and go. It's actually pretty snug. Too deep on each one of these. And then too deep on each one of those. Just happened to notice on the last step, I was supposed to put some wax in these slots. <laughs> so, go ahead and no time like the present. Just a little. And. Yep, got some in there. Alright. I say that, those will actually hold those in too, so that'll make it doubly good. Now, pop this guy on there. And then take our trigger. I think it's a trigger and our spring assembly from the last step. Here, that way, that way. And the bottom one goes through that hole. Okay, 
in it. It's gonna lock in place. I think I'm gonna. I think I got clearance to do this without. Yeah, I think I can do this. Don't have to be in place to do that there. All right. Okay, then this one goes up right through there. And then, actually, I'm gonna keep going on these. That's I don't think I don't think I'm coordinated enough to. Oh, wait a second. G's go in first. <laughs> Two on here. This side. goes in looking at the okay facing that way with the top section there okay. all right now let me see if there's any more to do <laughs> On this, uh, turn the page turned out. Okay, that's the last I can do before installing it. <laughs> so do it to this point. Pop her in there. And now this one. Yeah, on this side. Lining all these guys up with mm. all right. That was not too bad. <laughs> now we get I think it's guys out and they go on the send oh. <laughs> Whoop, a couple of scrap pieces eh, it's not gonna have room to nope Supposed to put wax in these slots too. I forgot about. <laughs> I don't know how they expect you to put the wax in there if you used their actual little chunk of wax that came with it, because <laughs> that will not fit in that slot. does work so okay okay do, 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 do. okay now we're doing some G's and H's go together They go over here, so okay, yeah, that's the locket mechanism in place. If I'm nice to it, <laughs> get any. Okay, that should be pretty sturdy. So, okay, there she goes. Amen. Mm 
I've got good solid clearance through there. So go one more time. Yep, do that. Yep, yeah, that's right. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Okay, this side was more, more cooperative, <laughs> or that one was. Yeah, a little bit easier on that. Okay. Now. pigs, two long ones and one short one on either side. Short one and there. The long ones all the way in. Locking everything in place there. That worked good. supposed to put the <laughs> rubber band in before I did all that but I, but it should still work yes yeah, just go from here underneath this doodad so I'll just go grab my, oh, there's my hooker, hooky one Somewhere in all this mess, I've got one that's an actual hook. That would have been ideal for that. Here you go there, up here around, and there. All right, so that means when we pull it up, it locks in place for us automatically. I'm not gonna dry fire it just yet. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That concludes step six. So let's fill this some wheels in step seven and finish this bad boy up. We'll be right back with that. Okay, here we go. Step seven, the last step of this one. Let's see. Huh? I lose track of it. I don't know if this was a quick build or not, but let's see here. Good. Go. G1. C1, F1, and H1, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Let's see here. Line these up and find out. I think. Okay, they're not exactly the same. Okay. <laughs> okay what's it? They might be. Oh, yeah, just gotta. Uh, Gotta find the right. Okay, it does matter. Of course, they're not labeled, and I did not keep track of which one's which. Okay, I imagine we'll be able to figure it out by whether or not the peg goes all the way through. <laughs> yeah, let's see here. This top. Mm -hmm. These are supposed to line up with the spokes it says okay so I got spokes lined up and the holes lined up there so I have then F1 this guy oh, I got that facing the wrong way anyway <laughs> all that work There we go. Now, okay, so I was I got the little symbols on. Hopefully, yeah, that lines everything up. And <coughs> this on last. Hmm. 
That's not lined up. Okay, so evidently I need one of the other ones. So this one doesn't look like it's lined up the same. So. <laughs> Got it. So, oh. And then just these guys go all the way through. Actually, I think it'd be easier to stick them in here first. Because it looks like they're fairly loose on these middle sections. So. they were going to be loose. Said we should have all, should know all the pieces are correct now. <laughs> okay, decorations to the outside. Line up that symbol. And these guys all the way around again. This one should go quicker. <laughs> One would hope. First try there. Gotta love that. Okay. Well, got our wagon wheels. Now, bring back the cannon. And you. Seven times two. Yep. Okay, so. Found it's easier to apply the wax to the inside of the yes than it is on the on the hub. That's the same effect, but <laughs> I'll hit a little bit on there. But you in around a little bit and work it in. Outside, F10, F7, 
seven. And a little peg to hold the uh, hold the pin in place. Alright. Okay, mm -hmm. waxing real good. It's not like I'm ever going to take it anywhere or tow it anything by those wheels, but it's good to know they do. <laughs> All right, and repeat on this side, which was F9, F5, C7 times 2. And since I'm here, I'll go ahead and hit the wax on this. Like I said, just a little bit on here. Some more. Here I think is better. <laughs> and pop you in. That is a completed can cannon. So only one thing left to do. <laughs> right, locked in, loaded, and got trigger here. It works. <laughs> a whole lot better than those old clear blue ones I had when I was a kid. Oh, and you can like aim it and stuff. Of course, not can't go too far because it rolls away from you. But oh, yeah, and you gotta be able to let it go too. <laughs> okay, that's I'm yeah I'm far too easily entertained. But <laughs> All right, uh, fully functional works. Got her. Wheels looks good, I think. Nice all around design. It looks like, I'll show you here. I noticed it looks like there should be a cross member down here, but there's not. And according to the instructions, I don't see anything left over that I missed, but it looks like there was, a, at some point in the design, there was a slot. There's a slot there to stabilize it, but I, I guess they decided against it. Because it, I say, I'm looking at the pictures and it's not in the. Yeah, I can't see it on the front. All the angles are from here, so. <laughs> but I said, I don't know if that was just something they changed their mind on or. Okay, okay I'm gonna have to, like, I can do that all day. But anyway, that's it that for that one. So, as is tradition. Start up before I start. Give you a preview if you made it this far into the video. Picked up another something else I picked up from Timu. Let me get a little more. It's evidently, I think it looks like there's an electric motor in there. I don't even know. I haven't even looked. It should be written on here somewhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't, but it, yeah, it looks like there, I don't see any, a lever or anything, so it looks like there's a motor in it. Get our little dudes on here sawing and pulling and pumping and whatever, but yeah, so I saw that. It was a cheapo, so I said, well, I'll take a look at that. So it's, it's 194 pieces, but I think a lot of them are going to be in the building our little guys. But anyway, that's coming up tomorrow. Should be a fairly quick build, I would think doesn't look overly complicated and we'll then after I get done with that we'll figure out what else I'm going to do but anyway back to the ring cannon back up thanks for watching everybody like subscribe comment complain share do whatever you want to with all that be good to one another stay safe and I'll see you next time